I've donned my Star Wars Christmas jumper. It's Darth Vader there. He says, I find your lack of cheer disturbing. Well, welcome back, guys. It's the Raw Geek here. Yes, it's going to be New Year very soon here. So, Happy New Year, depending on when you're watching this video. Now, you may be wondering, why am I showing this? off what's going on well this is Star Wars theory I've featured him before on my channel he's a bit you know pretty big youtuber now 2.78 million subscribers I think maybe it was a million the first time I looked at his channel uh, a couple years ago so you know doing very very well he's really knowledgeable he knows everything really there is to know about Star Wars he makes lots and lots of videos uh, so I would recommend checking him out and two years ago he released this fan film uh, Vader episode 1 and well I basically did the reaction to it uh, on, on my channel and it was epic, it was amazing and if you've not watched that episode I would go and look at that now if you're interested because I'm about to talk about it and see the next episode and I'm not a massive Star Wars nerd but I did kind of know enough to work out that there was teased that maybe Mace Windu was alive because there was an Amethyst lightsaber and indeed it is about Mace Windu being alive. And now a couple years later, he's got episode 2 which we're going to check out in a minute. There was a lot of controversy with the video because basically it got uh, blocked by Disney or an arm of Disney and said oh you can't do that. And he actually basically had permission from George Lucas himself really to make it. But then Disney came along and like, oh no, you can't do that, that's our property. Which was a bit harsh because he put a lot of effort into it. And they basically, in the end, monetized his video. So all the work he put into it, they got the money for. But they did, after some back and forth and stuff, they allowed the video to be shown. Because they were threatening at one point to ban, get his channel banned. <laughs> this is just what these massive corporations do but unfortunately there you go but like I say in the end they saw sense and they were like okay fair enough you can have it there as long as you don't make money from it which I think you know is a fair compromise just to quickly show I've got I've done my Star Wars Christmas jumper it's Darth Vader there he says I find your lack of cheer disturbing so I thought it was fitting to wear it while watching it the video dropped a few days ago before Christmas but I didn't get notified even though I've got notifications turned on all notifications turned on as you can see YouTube didn't tell me, it didn't tell me, didn't tell me the video dropped, didn't tell me, in fact it barely ever tells me he uploads anything. I know for a fact that notifications don't always work, I know with my channel definitely some people never get notified even though they've got it turned on, some people only randomly get notified even though they've got all turned on. The notification system is just bad on YouTube, but it's surprising even for a big YouTuber for it to not work great because usually it seems to target smaller channels, but I don't know about that. Maybe the whole system just isn't that good. But anyway, I do now know it's dropped. So this is the video we're about to watch. It's only three minutes long, but I think he's working on episode three as well. But we know it's Mace Windu involved because it says that Vader episode two, Mace Windu returns, the Amethyst Blade cinematic. It says here, Vader's arrival on Naboo from Vader Episode 1, Shards of the Past. It's prefaced with the events you're about to witness with the clone troopers and the surviving Jedi Master from Order 66, Mace Windu, the one who wields the Amethyst Blade. This fan film is not for profit, not monetizing, will not be monetized on YouTube or anywhere else in accordance and respect to Lucasfilm's explicit rules to me, which is fair enough. This short fan film is dedicated to Star Wars fans, George Lucas, blah, blah, blah. Thank you for the team. There's a team helped him. The clone voices. I left a note saying I'm going to watch this and react to it myself. I won't be monetizing my video. I didn't monetize my reaction to episode one. It's all his and his team's work. It's not right, in my opinion, to try and make money off of their work, especially when they're not even allowed to monetize the video themselves. <laughs> so I won't be monetizing this. Hopefully, it doesn't get blocked by Disney or something or Lucas or something like that. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, let's watch. And once again, if you haven't seen the first episode, do go check that out. But otherwise, let's take a look. This video is fan production by Star Wars Theory, and we're not monetized in accordance to rules. Ah, oh, thanks. Home trip is there. Oh, it's animated, that's cool. Who 
Looks really good. Sir, we're in position. <gasps> uh oh. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. A purple blade? Guys, just run. Why are you still standing there? Oh um, no. It's my sweet dude. Just drop me gun and say I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my word. He means business. That's where he found him. He's upstairs. Oh, he looks pretty damaged. He's not happy, is he? That is cool. I want to see him fight. He's got he's got a score to settle, old Mace Windu. Awesome. Well, that was cool. So yeah, he went CGI with that one, which I think is perfectly understandable and worked really well. It was like watching The Clone Wars. The first episode was live action. Of course, a lot of CGI for the effects, but it was live action, real actors. That was just CGI like The Clone Wars. I thought it was awesome. I thought it looked amazing. It was a lovely tease for Mace Windu there, taking out those clones that were after him. Looks like he's gonna be doing a duel with Darth Vader maybe in episode 3. He's got a score to settle with Anakin so I mean that looks it looked awesome and um, yeah I, I think he just does an amazing job with the videos he makes and the team that's obviously helped him. What do you think guys? Did you really enjoy that? I hope you've seen both episodes like I say I, once more I will say do go and watch the first one it is epic honestly it's really really good that was really good too. Looking forward to a third if he manages to make it and I'm glad he's allowed to have it on his channel, not monetized, which I think is fair enough, it's a fair compromise, uh, but at least he could he could have it on his channel and he can watch it. So yeah, pretty good. So once again guys, Happy New Year, I uh, hope you're having a good one, you're safe and well, have it as much fun as you can or whatever, and uh, well, we'll see you in 2021. So guys, if you like that, please click like, make sure you subscribe for more videos like this, and I'll see you on the next video, and until then, remember, may the force be with you. Okay, bye. Guys, if you're still here, you're awesome! Uh, but as you are still here, why not check out some of my other videos? Oh, and if you haven't already, please click subscribe. Laters, haters.